Uh, all right. Uh, today, I'm delighted to be talking to comedian and actress and uh, just all around funny girl, Miss Deirdre O'Kane. It's lovely to chat to you. Um, I don't think in terms of uh, professionally performing, you don't get you don't come to the county that often. But uh, do you get the chance to visit Kerry when uh, whenever you can? Ha- or do you come down and, here at all? Uh, geez, I mean, the whole country visits Kerry. Sure, that's the most popular county in the country, isn't it? Uh, I'm I'm very lucky. I have I have a lot of friends who have nice houses down in that part of the world, so I I get invited. I get invited. To stay with people. Actually, my my last three summers, I've I've had a little bit of time in Kerry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, you're bringing the Demented tour down to us. It's been a long time. Have you actually Demented. played in the in the IEC before, or is this your first I time? I think I played it once, so I think it's my mm. second time. I think I took my last show. There goes the microphone toppling over. Um, but I couldn't be positive, which really does say an awful lot about the state of my mind. Um, <laughs> I think I, I think I took my last show. Um, yeah. The show, the Dancing with the Stars show. I think I played that there, yeah. Talk to me about uh, Demented. Where does the name come from? Is it something that uh, you are, you're familiar with yourself or is, is it a topic you're just exploring? Demented seems to be my permanent state of mind at the moment. Um, it came from the two years of COVID and Jesus, just the madness of what we've all been through for the last couple of years. And uh, and to add to that, you know, within that period, I got older, you know, when I really couldn't afford to. I'm trying to hang on to this face for another few years, get a few more telly jobs out of it. Do you know what I mean? I thought I can't afford to be hidden away for two years. I, I need to, I need to put my best face forward. So I got older. I became a woman of a certain age. Uh, I've got teenagers. I'm parenting them. I've got older parents who can't hear me on the phone. And um, I was just, I was, I was demented. I am demented permanently. It seems. Um, so that was the, that was where the title came from, and that's what it reflects. Yeah, and you're you're in, you're currently in the middle of uh, of the tour. How how have the last couple of shows gone? How how are the audiences, especially, are they enjoying enjoying the shows? Ah, they are, of course. Sure, I'm hilarious. Seventy five minutes straight is about cheaper than therapy. Um, <laughs> they're loving it. They are loving it. I think they're so relieved to be back. You know, I mean, I don't know if they're as relieved as I am, but my God, I thought I'd never get back out to to see the live audiences again. Um, it's just glorious. And the rolls of laughter, and it's just very gratifying. I think I'd forgotten how how much, and not until something's taken away from you, maybe that you just really realise how much you need it actually in your life. Did you write a lot of the show? It was it was it a lockdown kind of a thing, where you where you had a load of free time to be able to write, or has it been something you were I, working on maybe before it? It was a little bit of both. I had written about half. Uh, before the lockdown and then I'd say I wrote the second half over the previous uh, 18 months yeah 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 well you've been busy as well off off stage as well because uh, I I'm a big fan of goggle box I I love your commentary on that as well whenever I hear you on there um it's just one of those shows uh, that just took off one this morning, actually. yeah so, it's a mighty show wait and see tonight um I don't know if this goes out tonight now if I'm wasting people's time or not does this go up on your no, so Light so people, this will this will go out in two or three days. So we'll have seen it by the time this interview comes out. So uh, I mean, okay. you you could tell me what goes on tonight, but I I don't know. You well, could it, be fired just, as well by doing that. Yeah, no, I mean it's just very interesting. It's the coverage of the Queen and the the death of the Queen, and it's just the Irish public's reaction is fascinating to watch. It's actually very it's very moving and then also very Irish. So it's the perfect show, isn't it, Gogglebox? You just get the honest opinions. From people, uh, definitely, yeah. I think people just love watching people, and Irish people are just so nosy. I think that's like our number one trait above any other yeah. country in the world. We just want yeah. to know what the people next door are doing. We want to know what the people across the road are watching or oh. what they're doing. Oh, oh, totally. And we're also mad about ourselves. We're absolutely yeah. mad about ourselves. We think we are hilarious, and we 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 really love looking at other Irish people being funny. <laughs> uh, definitely. Yeah, yeah. No, it's a show I watch every week, so looking forward to seeing that as well tonight. Um, we're looking forward to having you back in the kingdom, Deirdre. It's been it's been a long time since people have seen you uh, perform on stage down here. You said you were in the Strictly uh, Dancing with the Stars, should I say, to avoid any yeah. copyright copyright trademarks. Uh, Dancing with the Stars. Uh, that's the last time we saw you now, so we're looking forward to seeing you again. It'll be this coming Friday 
uh, in the INEC club. And uh, it's always a pleasure. I cannot wait. I swear to God, I cannot wait to hear that Kerry crowd. It fills my heart with joy. So, they sound uh, like no other. They sound like no other. They're, 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 they're definitely unique. Yeah, yeah. from show. Uh, perfect. Dear, they're lovely to chat to you. And uh, we will yeah, see you down yeah. in the county later on this yeah. week. Thank you very much. Thanks a million. Thanks for having me.